Hello Conquerors, and welcome to new episode of Retro Mech Arena, don't know which one is but new episode. This episode is coming very late because of my exam, otherwise it would have come much earlier. But what can I do, my exam is about to come again. Let us now come to our main topic, Railgun, or, you can also call it Editez. You must have seen this picture of Railgun, which people are also calling Railgun 12. It was going very viral. You must have seen its video on YouTube, in which you were being told that a new railgun is about to come, but let me tell. That this is not a new railgun nor is it the only railgun that is going to come forward. Because when the game was new, then there was a whole family of railguns in it. Editez Coil, Editez Gauss which we know today as Railgun 16, and Editez Zeus. Let's not talk about their stats. Leave all this for another video. We already know that how dangerous is Railgun 16. So on this basis you can find out how dangerous his whole family will be. So in order to balance the game, two railgun were removed from it. Editez Coil and Editez Zeus. Then later his name was changed from Editez's to VLG, wherever E-D-I-T-E-Z was written, it was changed to VLG. If you play the game with a new account, you will get a bot at the time of training using Railgun 16 named VLG Gauss. If you want more information on this, then you can watch the video of Scape211. He made a video on it in detail. Anyway, they had to figure out that one was too powerful, Editez Zeus. Even if two left Editez Coil and Editez Gauss, then a player would get both in his hand, that player would have become very powerful. It would have been impossible to beat that player that time. So a cool way was found to balance the game, in which the most powerful, Editez Zeus, and lowest railgun or can you say weak railgun, Editez Coil was removed in the balance which was the middle railgun was left, Editez Gauss which we know today as Railgun 16. When all this was happening, many people had not even unlocked the railgun. Because it was very difficult to unlock, it was in the hands of very few people. Mine was not unlocked either. Or can you also say that all this was planned to earn money later, maybe it could be. This was the story of Railgun's family. Now let's talk about when it can come in the game? Earlier we used to get it in the crate absolutely free. There was no a coins hassle. Unlock means unlock. We didn't have to buy that thing. Then came the XP path. But we know that now nothing will come in the XP path. And as I think and you would also think that many weapons are suddenly coming in the event crate rush, which weapon we had never heard about before. Like Longarm 12. And we also know that the weapons that were removed earlier are also coming. Like Javelin Rack 8, and Stasis Bean 8. So these two railguns can also come at any time. So be ready with your money. How was my joke? I hope that you have got some information about Railgun's family through this video. If I have missed any information, you can let me know on my Discord server. You will find its link in the description. And I just want to say that if you have not subscribed to our channel yet, then you can, because many more videos are going to come like this. So that was it for today. See you in the next video.